It was a sorry sight as the magnitude of the gully has totally taken over the area with Ediage Road already cut off from other parts of Benin City. The houses in the neighborhood are not only threatened, but some have already caved in, forcing occupants to relocate. The frightening dimension of the gully is such that if urgent steps are not taken to check the minas, the situation in Ediage Street and its environs in Ogbeson community, more houses are likely to cave in. Some of the residents who spoke to the new school narrated the LD, especially during the rainy season when flood would take over the whole area. They said now that another rainy season is fast approaching, they have no choice but to appeal to the state governor, Godwin Obaseki, who they described as a listening leader to come to their rescue. Over some year, we have been suffering from more than how many years? We can't go home when dry season comes, rainy season comes, we don't see where to go to our houses. People are still appealing to the state government and the agency to please help us to come and do this truth. Uh, I'm going my mommy and government, you know, help me. Why you love where we do? I mean, la. I'm much men, I don't know how to do. You may you would do. I mean, I mean, I owe where I care you. Government, I beg. Because I see this road job be now. It just carry our house finish. If it, if it really is a corner, if you're not going to let us send children go to school. I beg, we just beg you now. I beg, Mona, help us. We try. We try for this road, but we not succeed. We not fit. government Although no government official was immediately available to comment on whether or not there is any plan to address the situation, investigation by the new school revealed that paperwork on the road is already ongoing. A source revealed that there is also the possibility that once the road is done, a bridge is likely to be constructed to link the road to other parts of St. Xavier and Upper Sakumba, which we serve as a bypass. A Fosa Wangwe reporting.